Hey, check out this funny looking wall. Just kidding, it's not a wall. It's a tree. Today we see some giant trees. We're gonna go to Cathedral Grove. It's home to Canada's largest trees. A thick patch of fog, lots of fog here. Okay, I'm at Cathedral Grove. And it's busy, like there's lots of cars around. There's lots of cars and I can already see some big trees just sitting here on the highway, but I'm gonna show you guys some, some cool big trees right away. Okay, so the largest trees are about 800 years old, but most here are 300 years old because of a fire. Okay, here's the uh, here's the map. That's where we are. A bunch of people just went that way, so I'm gonna go this way. We're gonna maybe I, maybe I'll do like a little figure eight. I'll go this way and then that way. I don't know. I'll figure it out. These Douglas firs are massive, and Douglas firs actually have a little bit of a secret weapon against forest fires, and that's because they don't have a lot of low limbs. So any forest fires that start, usually typically low in the forest, uh, there's not as much tree to catch on fire. So you can see like there's not a lot of leafage until you get to the top top parts of the trees. So look at these. Look at these. Wow. All right. Uh oh. That's okay. I'm so sorry. Here's a comparison of this tree to the Leaning Tower of Pisa. Boom. This tree is huge. Look at this. Look at this. Look at that. It's nine meters in circumference. That's like 30 feet around. Wow. Wow. Literally, all these trees are just, they're just huge! It's the size of me! Look! It's, uh, it's the size of me. It's a, it's a tree. Like, just look at, just look at that. Look at that! It's actually amazing that, like, these big trees, they survived the lumberjacks of the 19th century. Because those dudes cut everything down. Cathedral Grove? Amazing. Um, it's just like, yeah, I don't know. I can't even put into words like. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna carry on our journey. Another food I eating. It's a banana wrap. You put some put some peanut butter, some Nutella if you have it. Mine froze, so it's all chunky now. But yeah, you do that. Peanut butter, whatever you want. Put a banana across and a tortilla. Roll that shit up. Wow, it's good. <laughs> it's like a it's like a protein packed semi good for you power bar okay i'm past port alberty and like this highway is just full of beautiful views like like there's mountains on the other side of these trees and like every kilometer or so there's just like a nice waterfall that you can see all the way from here it's super cool at a place on the side of the road it's called valley creek look they do that cute lock thing here too a lot more people do it here so yeah do it here yeah check this out look at that Wow. Now this, this is right, wicked. That's the type of stuff that'd be fun to hit in a kayak. It's like not even sketchy to walk on this tree. It's just big. Okay, I just passed the fork where it splits to Uslet or Tofino. I'm going to Tofino. Um, man, that was a gorgeous drive, but it is a dangerous drive. Like everywhere you go is just sharp, sharp turns and you dip and you yeah, we're gonna check out Tofino. I don't know if there is gonna be anywhere for me to park there because it's a pretty small place. And I'm sure they probably get lots of people like me coming through here, like van people. Um, if that, if like worst case scenario, there is a hostel, I could see about staying at the hostel because they got all sorts of stuff there. They got a sauna, they got, I could do my laundry and you can get like access to surf renting and stuff like that. Just passed a sign that said entering tsunami hazard. That's the first time I've ever seen that sign, but I like it. I mean, I don't like it, but it means we're somewhere cool. Okay, I stopped at Long Beach. 
Wow. Wow. Oh. My god. This is breathtaking. I think I can see Japan. Just kidding. Okay, so far I really, really like Tofino. Um, we're at this place called Radar Hill. And apparently there's a wicked lookout. So, gonna look. Okay, now the typical thing I would say here is, wow. But this deserves something a little different. Holy shit! Oh! Wow. Wow, wow, wow. And you even get an echo here. Woo! That carries a long way. Wow. I understand why so many people say Tofino is the most beautiful place on earth. So this place we're at, it was called Rayar Hill because this was where the first line of defense was from Soviet bombers. They would be detected by the radar here. So this would have been the site of the old radar detecting equipment. That's going to be it for this video. If you liked it, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And let trees grow, because like, damn. I'm at, I'm at Cathedral Grove. Oh, shoot. Okay, I'm at Cathedral Grove.